Vlog Moo. <laughs> On today's episode, we're doing a little bit of a throwback review. And uh, we're going back to the vault. Back before we even had Grubbin to the <laughs> to the uh, uh, 22 second beer reviews here. And we're trying an old beer that we really did not enjoy back in the day. But we think our palates have advanced enough that we might have a new appreciation of it. Yeah, there's several beers that I remember drinking. Like, it's like, let's try this. And it's just like, ah, oh, what the hell is this? And like, yeah. now, I, I kind of, I've been drinking some of the styles of some of these beers. Yeah, yeah. Exa exactly. It's like, uh, I think we, you know... Uh, we've had enough experiences as far as beers go to be able to reevaluate these things in a, in a new light. So I think this is a great vlog series that we're gonna we're gonna do with a lot of things. But starting here, we're trying uh, Delirium <laughs> Tremens, a uh, Belgian style beer that we absolutely hated the first time we tried it. Uh. We have not tried it since then. This was like fucking four years ago. 8.5 ABV. Yeah, I just... Ah, oh, man. I just remember when I first tried this shit, I just was yeah. like, oh, this is the fucking worst tasting beer ever. It wasn't a super good experience, but I mean, we've had so much since then. I've had worse beers, I think. Yeah, for sure. Like, uh, uh, uh Beelzebuth, right? Like, we had some of that for the uh, 100 guy or four guys 100 cups with yeah. reckless eating and, and I like, actually enjoyed it then. Yeah, when we tried it after after the first time we hated it, but like that time it was like, you know, that's not too bad. So, hopefully same experience here. I have a feeling we're going to like this one now. I, I it bet. smells good. <laughs> I bet we will. <laughs> All righty. Oh yeah, that's fucking delicious, dude. <laughs> I can't believe we didn't like this before. Yep, that's how your taste changes, oh, though. Oh, man. It's all about experiencing such a huge range of things. Yeah, it's got that nice citrusy tart kind of, since it's as bubbly as what it is, it's mm -hmm. almost like drinking a fucking champagne. It's so good. God damn it, dude. <laughs> oh, I, like, spit this shit out when I tried it first. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And this, ah. Uh, it's amazing how fucking eating... Fucking fermented tofu <laughs> and beans cake and stuff. <laughs> it makes you realize there's yeah. <laughs> there's some things that aren't so bad. It broadens like, your horizons a little whew, bit. Fucking a man. Ooh, it smells sweet and foamy. It's nice in that style of beer. I like the fact that you can smell foam. Mmm. No, that's good. It gives you a certain amount of sweetness. It has a little bit of that grassy flavor, a little bit of that funky yeast going on in there, but it's just a little bit. Like, I can't believe we we didn't like this beer from the beginning. It's so fucking good now. It's like, we've had so many things that this... This isn't even, like, weird anymore. This is, like, sort of just kind of standard and done pretty well, like, c compared to other beers we've had. It's kind of like a, um... An extra powerful hoe garden. That's kind of what I was thinking. As you were describing it, I'm like, yeah, it's a hoe garden. It is, it is. And I just had one of those today. So I'm like, yeah, it's like a rich hoe garden. That's that's a pretty excellent beer. Like, there, there's nothing offensive about that. That's pretty decent. Uh, we're going to have to try more of these old so beers. So many beers that we hated. Yeah, uh, there's so <laughs> many beers way back in the day that we tried that we didn't like. We're gonna have to revisit those, and we're gonna do it here on Vlogmo. Uh, here's this is the first one, uh, Delirium Tremens. Thank you for watching. <laughs>